Thinnings are critical to my operation um, because we made a choice uh, a number of years ago to move in to cut the length uh, in, um, I mean, not that cut the length doesn't work well on clear cuts too, but they, they are really designed to thin. Uh, it's still critical to my operation. I mean, it's it's uh, summer wood. Um, um, in the long run, we're ending up with a, a better quality of timber. Um, I've noticed it myself, you know, watching these uh, stands over the years, and there is a better quality of timber than what there used to be. I guess I like to see there's that there's still something left when I'm done. Uh, it just gives me a nicer environment to work in versus just a, a big clear cut. Not that I'm opposed to that. I mean, there's different ways to manage timber, and I think these like these hardwood stands. Um, I think they should be thinned until they are ready to final fell, I guess. When, when we meet with the landowner, you know, we try to um, emphasize the value of, of getting the work done first and doing it right and increasing the value of their stand long term. And, and that's beneficial for us because if, if we go in and do a quality job and um, build a relationship with them, um, next time around, uh, nine times out of ten, they're going to call us back to, you know, do another quality job. And it makes it easier for me to buy timber because they, a lot of them guys, don't like to see uh, clear cuts or. Uh, I, I think there's going to be more of it in the future, um, and hopefully, the private landowners start realizing uh, what it's about. And I'm, I'm sure the county and state is going to continue doing it. Um, from what I've seen uh, in the 26 years that I've been doing it, um, I am seeing a lot better quality of timber.